Hello. Let's talk a little bit about touch today. Now, we have to think about compliance, and you have to remember your training, and you've got to keep in mind gender issues. You have to keep in mind age appropriateness. All of the things you've been trained in, we don't want to forget. However, touch is so important. I'm a hugger. That's just, I like to hug. Uh, hugs are good to me. Uh, when you touch somebody, it releases oxytocin, it releases serotonin, and that good, does some wonderful things. It helps people be happy. It can relax people. Some would say it lowers your blood pressure. Imagine that. That's better than medicine. You can reduce fear. You can either reduce and sometimes eliminate stress with something as simple as a hug. You got to be careful with full frontal hugs and who you're hugging there. But it's not just a hug, folks. Sometimes meaningful touch can be a high five. It can be nucks. It can be elbows. Sometimes it can be hold a hand and walk for a little bit. But meaningful touch is so important. There's a reason why Jesus touched lepers. It's because they weren't just sick in their body. They were also sick in their soul because nobody would touch them. And everywhere they went, they had to announce that they were unclean. And so there was just damage done internally. And Jesus would touch them. And what that was saying to them was, you're in my world. You're real. I see you. And you matter to me. Think about touch. Think about hugs. Think about high fives handshakes, patting a kid on the back. Don't forget, because sometimes that's really all they need to be okay for a little while. Blessings.